hello everybody and welcome back to my channel today i have an empties product that i used up for you guys everything here in this um bath and body works bag yes i have been doing a lot of empties products lately i have two my last two videos were bath and body works empties products um i've just been using up a lot of stuff and i want to show you guys what i like and what i dislike and things that can save you money and this is just um my opinion of what i like what i might like you might not like and vice versa so if you like these type of videos give it a like hit that subscribe button and that gray notification bell right next door so you are notified every time that i upload a video and without further ado we'll just jump right in i'm gonna grab and go so the first thing i have here are these puffs um simple simple softness tissues these are nothing um nothing spectacular um they're just random tissues. These are nice to have. And flu season is just around the corner. Cannot believe it snuck up on us. And these are good to stock up on. I like to have at least one of these in the bathroom at all times. Each bathroom that we have. So this one is perfect. You cannot go wrong with tissues. And then my family used up the Swathe Central Ocean Freeze Refreshing Body Wash. And they just said it was okay. Nothing spectacular. But let me just tell you. Um, this scent smells so good. I do love the scent on this. And you could probably find you can find this Walmart, Target, Family Dollar, Dollar General, Walgreens. They probably have so anywhere that has like a um, personal hygiene, body care um, aisle. They're probably gonna have this. And you know, um, this is nothing spectacular, but um, if you want something like inexpensive, I would say go ahead and grab this. Okay, so the next thing that I used up were two of the Tree Hut body scrubs. Let me tell you, I absolutely love the Tree Hut body scrubs. Last year during Christmas time, we, my work did a Secret Santa um, gift giving exchange. And somebody got me one of these for, not not this one, but got me a um, Tree Hut body scrub and absolutely fell in love with it. I saw a hype on it. I wanted to try it, but I didn't want to spend the money for it. And it was, it was amazing and it's life changing. As you can tell, I bought some more. This one here is in the strawberry one. This one, I love anything, pretty much anything to do with strawberries. It's, um, it's the Shea Sugar Scrub. This one, I loved. I loved. I would repurchase this one. They have this out, I believe, all year round. And then this is the Hessian Vanilla Bean Sh Shea Sugar Scrub. And this one I was not a big fan of. I mean, it did the same thing as the strawberry one. But this one gave me a headache pretty much every time that I used it. And I was just, no. But what I really like about these is they're made in the USA. So that is perfect. Um, so I'm excited, you know. I say with these, you only need to use these once or twice a week, and that's it to get the dead skin off. You know, they exfoliate just a little bit more than what, like, a shower gel would do with these. I definitely recommend using. Okay, so next thing here is the Dove Hair Therapy. It's the Hydration Spa Shampoo, and I actually like this. It worked really, really good. You know, I wash my hair about two times a week. That's all I do, unless I'm doing something outside. But yeah, this stuff is great. I love how it came with a pump. Very, um, it definitely volumizing. It did a really good job. I would definitely pick this one up again, but Dove can be a little bit on the pricey side. So I would say wait till you have a coupon or this stuff is on sale. Then I used up some toothpaste. This one here is the Crest 3D white toothpaste absolutely love this stuff i definitely feel like my teeth has been a lot cleaner using this one it's so good guys i would recommend this one and i would also recommend the crest pro health one of my subscribers here actually recommended this so i gave it a try and this one was really good as well these have to be probably one of my favorite toothpaste um this is great you cannot go wrong with this um i'm not supposed to use a whole ton of whitening so i kind of just be careful how much of this stuff i use and it says remove up to 90 percent of surface stage it says start whitening after one brush 
you know, I see a little bit of a difference, not too much on the whitening, but you know, as long as I feel like my teeth are clean, that is what matters the most. So, um, highly recommend both of those toothpaste. And then I also used up the Colgate Total Whole Mouth Health. This is great for traveling. Um, I get these free from my dentist that I go to, and this one is really good, you know. Can't complain, free toothpaste. Oops, actually, I got two of them. So I definitely have to say I used up a lot of toothpaste. Let's go around. Then I have here the Put On Tex Act Active Gum Health Daily Wash. This one is really good for my teeth, especially I have some um, issues with like my gums and things like that. So um, this is really good. I use it, tr I try to use it every day. Sometimes I don't use it, um, but this is really good. Uh, they don't have coupons on this a lot, but when they do, I definitely like to snag that up. But um, yes. Walmart has this. I don't know of Target, but um, yes. It says Target bacteria and and forms an antibacterial shield, and it's clean mint. So this this is really good. And then I have some makeup remover wipes. I have two simple ones. This one is in the simple daily skin detox. It's a clear and matte cleansing wipes. This one was a really good one. I find these find makeup wipes at TJ Maxx and people were saying that these work very, very good. So, um, or simple wipes work good. And this one wasn't bad. It, it isn't like my absolute favorite, but this one was good. And then this one is these simple kind to skin exfoliating wipes. Now this one I also got at TJ Maxx and I have to say I did not like this one whatsoever. It was kind of rough on my skin. Um, it was not something I would repurchase. I do have one more left. I'm going to use it up so I don't like waste my money but um, this simple wipes I would not buy again. And of course I have my Neutrogena Ultra Soft Cleansing Towel Wipes. I used two of these and these are great i love these i actually have a stock i have like two more of these i always have at least three or four things of wipes just because i go through wipes um faster than what maybe some people use i use like one maybe two a day so um yes this is great i would highly recommend these and especially for sensitive skin this is really really good and then i have here the placards um Plackers, uh, what are these? Dental flossers, if I can remember what these are. These were good, I actually like these. I picked these up at the dollar store. You get 60 in here for a buck 25, not a bad deal. Um, I love these better than like the string where you wrap around your finger and try to put it in. These just make things so much easier. You can travel with these, these are wonderful. Then I have here the L Clean and Clear Lemon Zesty Scrub Buffs and Brightens with Gentle Micro Scrubbies. It's oil free and vitamin C. I love this stuff, especially when I get acne. I tend to get acne kind of like on my chest and my back. And like when I have my cycle, I get it like around my T zone. And this is very good. Um, I normally don't like lemon scents, but this one was pretty, the scent wasn't too strong, which I love. I, I would definitely recommend this. So I found this at TJ Maxx and this one was really, really good. Um, for, it says for bright, bright, for bright, clear, happy skin. And it, I really felt like it did a difference to my skin. I used it every day and it was good. And then I have here the Pantene Lightweight Finish Alcohol-Free Hairspray. And for the longest time, I was trying to find hairspray or just products that don't have have minimal to no alcohol in their products and this one does not and i love it i've already bought a backup of this one and it's just it's amazing it's a hold level two it's not the hold is not super strong but it is enough and it doesn't make your hair feel super sticky like a lot of them do with the alcohol one with the alcohol in them 
The only downfall about this is I wish this one would have came, like, when you're traveling. I wish they had a travel size of this one. I haven't been able to find one, but this one is really good. I would recommend this one if you want to get out of that that habit of ha having a lot of products with alcohol because that stuff dries your hair out and it damages it. So, yeah. <laughs> And then I have here the SGX NYC Dry Touch Volumizing Shampoo, or not, Volumizing Dry Shampoo, and this stuff is amazing. I would definitely recommend this stuff. Um, I want to let you know, just be careful with the Batiste shampoo. I bought that stuff, and then I guess there was a recall on that stuff probably a few weeks ago. It was causing some, like, cancer stuff, so don't be getting the Batiste stuff. Return it if you have if you haven't so um this stuff is amazing you can get it at walgreens target it's a little pricey um but yeah this stuff works it doesn't make my hair good i can get some of like the grease out i kind of just use it it's like towards the back of my head and like my roots that's the best part or areas to use the dry shampoo it works good um, because i only wash my hair about twice a week this is good for like those in between days so perfect and then I have the Urban Decay All Nighter Face Primer and I love this stuff this works really good um, I wouldn't say you have to have a primer for your makeup um, but I like it it just I feel like it sets it holds my makeup a little bit better so that is why I I get a primer this one just works. some of them don't work very good but this one works pretty good I would recommend it it is on a pricier side for um um for a face primer a little bit of this stuff goes a long way all it is is it's clear you put it like one pump and it goes around your whole face and it just works really good especially I feel like Having the face primers is good for like the summer days when it's super hot outside or you're going to a theme park and want to put like some makeup on. This is what you're going to need that face primer for. Yes. So guys, that was everything for this pretty big empties products that I used up. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye everybody.